so. I don't care about this place. It's about you! Call the cops. Morning, Stan. Here to inaugurate the new hydrant? Well, better christen it with my fire hose. Principal Lewis! Are you excited or terrified? I have to decide whether I'm joking or not. When Barry signals the deck is hot, you boys sit down and bet strong. Snot, you're Jewish. You'll be in charge of the money. Steve, you'll be in charge of watching Snot, because I don't trust Jews. Come on, let's go play some blackjack! Now? But we have geometry class. I'll write you a note. Dear math bitch, these kids ain't showing up. Love, your main man. P.S. One plus one equals the two of us. Plus, one more would be nice, though. Maybe Jill from the cafeteria. Or your sister Lisa. You know, when she's legal. All right, boys, time to have a little fun with the winnings. Gentlemen, we're gonna see boob. Afraid not. I'd like to bring you boys in there. I really would. But the only 14-year-olds allowed in there are performing on stage. Ah! <laughs> Ladies! Alfred Hitchcock! Good tale here tonight, Brian. Who wants to see me pee on this cake? Ah. Oh, no. oh, no. oh. Yeah, Superintendent! Blast my Buddha belly! <laughs> Sweet, you kill my master. Now you die. Cake! Cake! Pie! Brownie! Cookie! 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 hasn't peed on any cakes, and hasn't challenged a dog to a fistfight in days. <sighs> so go on. Do what you were born to do. Go punch that dog in the face. Hmm? You're a good friend. Any hoots, it's time for me to do what I do best, and that's whatever I want all the time! Wow, he just takes what he wants, doesn't he? When we come back, local strongman Brian Lewis! My strength comes from above! <sighs> Society's given up on these kids, the school's given up on these kids, their own children have given up on these kids. They're looking, they're looking at us. You think they can read lips? They can't read books! They're a bunch of dumbasses with no future. <gasps> There's no glass. Fresh meat! <laughs> Lewis gets away again! Well, he did go to Harvard. No, he didn't! Then how'd I get this sweatshirt? How'd he get the sweatshirt, Steve? What? Are you really asking? A sweatshirt doesn't mean anything! You calling me a fraud? Saying I didn't graduate from F-U-B-U? And you got the boot off Principal Lewis's car. So you've done a lot of good. Smith, meet me in the computer lab. Oh, damn it, Asian. This is not my fault, Stan. I was texting. Yep. Looks like the pottery class is coming in. Uh, perhaps we should relocate. As I am not legally permitted to be within 100 feet of the instructor, or more specifically, her sugary sweet ass. Oh, look! It's Principal Lewis! Hi, Principal Lewis! <coughs> what the hell? I'm getting to those kids first! I need that money! I'm not going back to that school! <laughs> Ah! Woo! People are excited. <laughs> Bitch, what are you crying about? I was counting on that money. I can't go back to work now. I took a deuce on my desk. <laughs> Yo! Clara, could you make me a nice hot chocolate? Clara, did you roll your gut? Dang eyes at him. Woman, I will make you teach summer school. I will steal your summer. First, we move you to a credit union. Better interest rates. Ugh. That's how you lose a summer, bitch. 
How much? Ten bucks to see it, twenty bucks to ride. No, I meant for the oranges. Not for sale, bitch! All right, I'll see it. What are you doing? Showing you my butt. What? You thought those were ding-dong prices? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Steve, I want you to be our new announcer. Me? Uh, thank you, sir. Here's your trophy. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Can you imagine if you got this big-ass trophy just for announcing? <laughs> no. No. A trophy like this is for when you star in over 40 adult films in under two months. That's how you get a trophy like this, son. This is Phyllis. She just moved here from Hoboken. I'd like you all to give her a warm welcome. Now, I'm not referring to the sexual position, the warm welcome, of which I am the inventor. The basic nature of the move is... Oh, never mind. You're only long enough. Ugh, damn kids! <sighs> Sometimes I think I should have just stayed in Peru, moving coke. Machado was a cold bastard, but he was good to his men. And once you drew blood for him, you were set. Hooch! Blow! Girls! <laughs> Not women! Girls! Little bitty things. Ryan! Oh. Doesn't mean you know everything about A, hey, Principal Lewis! End of day, bitches! <laughs> well? Who puts the meth into bath my best alto? Who gives the road that makes Barry very baritone? Yes, it's me. Now, Smith, take these PEDs. You have to for the good of the whole team. Yeah. This is the only thing that matters! Which is why it's going to me, Brian the Home Invader Lewis, a.k.a. the Basement Creep, a.k.a. Midnight Lace! Principal Lewis, what are you doing in our basement? I honestly have no clue. Last thing I remember, I was climbing in that window. There it is! alarm just my principal hey Steve I'm just telling a few people I'm making belt buckles now if you want to buy one check it out he's got red eyes from smoking weed I really can't believe you're an educator Brian my job's mostly administrative <coughs> doing a great job Francine oh hi Steve How yeah what it's Steve's hallway <laughs> That guy hit the super smart Indian girl who skipped several grades. How could he hit a girl? That's nice. Oh, uh, poor Reshma. That girl's nice to everyone. Hey, what's going on out here? This guy hit Reshma. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Like John and Yoko. You're Yoko. <laughs>